renal pathology specimen today i will take you through the identification and description of various specimen of the renal system before we begin let's quickly recap the basic format of any specimen description after looking at your specimen from all sides you begin with the words this is a wet mounted specimen of the organ measuring x y z cm showing an external and a cut surface you then go on to describe the external surface followed by a description of the cut surface if you see any lesions on the specimen whether cysts tumors or infarcts describe them under the following headings shape location color dimensions and appearance you then end with your diagnosis saying this is a specimen of xyz disease now that we have the format in mind let's talk about the specific specimen of the renal system our first specimen as you can see on the screen can be described as specimen of cut section of kidney measuring 12 by 6 by 1 cm enlarged and pale external surface capsule has been stripped off subcapsular surface has lobulated appearance cut surface corticomedullary differentiation is maintained pelvic collateral system is normal at places medullary congestion is seen ureter and blood vessels are not seen diagnosis large white kidney specimen of kidney 10 by 4 by 1 cm external surface shows coarsely granular appearance presence of few tiny cysts and scars cut surface cortex is narrowed medulla shows congestion and there is increase in perinephric fat diagnosis contracted granular kidney specimen of kidney 15 by 7 by 1 cm external surface shows two pale wedge shaped areas measuring 2.5 by 2.5 cm with base towards capsule and apex pointing inside surrounded by zone of hyperemia cut surface corticomedullary differentiation is lost similar wedge shaped areas seen also areas of hemorrhage seen diagnosis kidney infarct pale specimen of kidney 8 by 4 by 1 cm external surface shows presence of multiple pinpoint hemorrhages all over cortical surface cut surface corticomedullary ratio is normal diagnosis flea bitten kidney specimen of kidney measuring 8 by 5 by 1.5 cm capsule stripped off subcapsular surface shows multiple pale yellowish white areas of varying sizes one at lower pole show necrotic material diagnosis kidney pyemic abscesses specimen of enlarged kidney measuring 25 by 12 by 3 cm external surface shows irregular cystic outpouchings cut surface shows thinned out cortex and presence of cystically dilated pelvic collateral system pelvic mucosal appearance is rough diagnosis hydronephrosis specimen of kidney with 5 cm length of ureter kidney is 6 by 5 by 2 cm external surface nodular cut surface show markedly dilated pelvic collateral system large calculus seen ureter dilated diagnosis hydronephrosis with hydroureter with calculus specimen of kidney measuring 15 by 10 by 1 cm external surface shows few depressed scars and areas of hemorrhage cut surface majority of cut surface occupied by large 10 by 8 cm gray firm lesion showing alternate light and dark lines of zan thrombus specimen of kidney with tumor a small strip of normal kidney 3 by 0.5 cm seen at the lower periphery of specimen the remaining kidney is replaced by a tumor 11 by 10 by 1 cm grayish white with variegated hemorrhagic and pink translucent appearance diagnosis wilms tumor specimen of kidney 20 by 15 cm 
विद टू सेंटीमीटर लेंथ ऑफ यूरेटर एक्सटर्नल सरफेस शेप ऑफ किडनी डिस्टॉर्टेड विथ लोअर हाफ शोइंग बॉसिलेशन कट सरफेस नॉर्मल किडनी सीन इन अपर पोर्शन द लोअर हाफ शोज ट्वेल्व बाय ट्वेल्व सेंटीमीटर ट्यूमर येलो वाइट विथ एरियाज ऑफ हिमरेज एंड सिस्टिक अपियरेंस द ट्यूमर इज वेल सरकमस्क्राइब्ड डायग्नोसिस रिनल सेल कार्सिनोमा Well that's it from this video we hope this will help you answer more questions in your vivas stay tuned for more videos in the series we'll see you in the next one